On the edge of the crease, carried away by the good guys in black as Bailey then took a hit by John Kurtz right near that center ice divider. That's going to draw a crowd here as both teams were changing and plenty more than five skaters each on the ice. And now Kurtz is going to have to answer the bell here with Guillaume Lapine for that bump on teammate Casey Bailey. The big righty Lapine makes first contact. Kurtz came with a couple of uppercuts, but I don't think they really did a whole lot. Kurtz fell down. Lapine said, you want to get back up? Let's keep it going. And Lapine right now overpowering Kurtz has the Syracuse crunch forwards, arms just locked up here. Kurtz has yet to land a punch. Lapine with a short left jab. Now Kurtz getting the right free, but not doing much in the way of damage. Now a glancing blow off the chin of the Binghamton blue liner. The linesman not having yet jumped in. And Kurtz with an overhand right. That stung a little bit. And now Lapine, I would think, running out of gas, as is John Kurtz. They fall down to the ice, and that will bring Fighting Majors to each here at the 531 mark. That's answering the bell right there, especially if you're John Kurtz of Syracuse. They took exception to the hit by Casey Bailey up against the wall. 